Hello viewers, welcome back. The financial and economic advisor to the Iraqi Prime Minister, Mr. Mazhar Mohammad Saleh, confirmed on Saturday that the federal budget, which was approved by Parliament and ratified by the President of the Republic and entered into force last week, does not need to be borrowed yet. The budget is mainly based on a deficit due to setting the price of a barrel at 70 US dollar compared to high expenditures. But the budget deficit has solutions including the surpluses achieved in 2022 and other steps. He added if Iraq needs to borrow it will borrow internally through the issuance of treasury bonds by the Ministry of Finance. But selling a barrel of oil above 70 US dollar will reduce the deficit and a drop in the price of oil below 70 US dollar will create an additional deficit. Saleh pointed out that what is important is the stability of the annual average of oil prices and not its fluctuation within a month or two, as this is the measure with the amount of exported production. On 11 June 2023, the Iraqi parliament voted on the financial budget for three years. 2023, 2024, and 2025, after four consecutive parliamentary sessions due to differences between the political forces regarding a number of articles. Indeed, with a vote on all articles after some were removed and new articles were added to them. The value of the current year budget amounted to 197 trillion and 828,000 billion Iraqi dinar, about 152.2 billion US dollars, with a total deficit of 63 trillion Iraqi dinar, 48.3 billion US dollar. While the items of the budget for the year 2024 and 2025 were not published.